Лайбо они то по мне не буду умирать. And welcome to our marketing series. My name is Emma and I am Victoria and today we will teach you a little bit about the SWOT analysis. So what SWOT analysis is? Well, keep on watching and in few minutes we will explain to you. Exactly. We made this series as an interpersonalization of teachers that can teach you. So it won't be that boring. <laughs> Take a look. Does anybody know what SWOT analysis is? Never mind, my sweet little thing. SWOT analysis is an analysis which identifies strengths and weaknesses of a product, service and company and opportunities and the threats facing it. So let's begin with the strengths. company has a unique quality brand you can also say that your company is a global brand that mirrors how profitable you are because of the co-workers who work hard to get the company on the top of a marketplace so those you can see are the factors for strengths any questions well is everybody here I'm going to continue with the factors of SWOT analysis. The weaknesses of this analysis reflect the bad, unwanted situation and the characteristics of your company. Unfortunately, no one is perfect and with the business comes money, fame and the duties which can make your company die. You have to pay the attention to these factors. Is your company reputation the match? Is the interior communication effective? Do you innovate or do you have a lack of new products? Is the loyalty of your customers weak? Then, then you have a problem. Those are the factors of the SWOT analysis. Well, and that's all for... Good afternoon students. I said good afternoon students. <laughs> Today's lesson will be about the opportunities of the SWOT analysis. Open your book, page 29. If you come late for another lesson, I will cast you out. Back to work. Opportunities are giving the company new chances how to enrich their business on the market so-called developing market. It can become a thing if you find a gap on the market. If the company is able of the potential growth, it's good for your business. Any questions? Not paying attention again. For the next lesson, you will bring me your completed task on the page 29, exercise 1, 2, 3A, 3C, and 3D and on the following page 30 exercise 8, 9, 10 and 11. That's all for today. If you won't bring me your company task for another lesson, I will cast you out. Hello everyone, how was your day? My day was amazing. I wake up in the morning and it was not raining. You know, I love sunny days. 
and then on the way to my work, I met a friend of mine that we used to work together in one marketing company. So today we will learn about the SWOT analysis, the threats of the SWOT analysis. Do you remember SWOT analysis? So I will recapitulate it for you. So you have been learning about the strengths, weaknesses, opportunities and today traits of the SWOT analysis which are the external factors. Does anybody know what the price war is? Anybody? Just imagine two supermarket chains. They all have different prices for their goods. Me and my friends, we shop in the Tesco or maybe a little sometimes because they have a plenty products and goods to buy. You know, I love to cook and uh, what can I say? If I wouldn't be working in this marketing sphere, I probably have my own restaurant. Oh, it's the end of the class. Okay, see you next time everybody. We will continue in the SWOT analysis. Now you know what SWOT analysis is. We hope you had some fun through this lesson. See you next time in another episode of our marketing series. I'm Emma. And I'm Vicky. And, and we, we are here to teach you something about marketing. Everybody, thank you for watching. <laughs>